right, this skill is determining which decimal falls between two given decimals. In this problem, we need to find which answer choice falls in between 6.23 and 6.35. So let's write these two numbers down. All right, and we're going to go through each of the answer choices and figure out if these numbers fall in between these two numbers. If we look at the first answer choice, 6.39, if we can compare this, these numbers are the same, okay, the ones place and the tenths place are the same as 6.35. However, the number in the hundredths place, there's a nine in the hundredths place and there's a five in the hundredths place here. So this number, 6.39, is does not fall in between 6.23 and 6.35 because it is actually greater than 6.35. So let's try the next answer choice. The next answer choice is 6.15. Okay, right off the bat, you can see that 6.15 is actually less than 6.23 because the number in the tenths place is less. So 6.15, there's a one here, and that number is less than the number in the tenths place for 6.23. So we're gonna try the next number. So 6.39. And 6.15 were not viable options. Now, 6.25. Okay, is 6.25 greater than 6.23? Yes, it is. Is it less than 6.35? All right, well, let's check it out. The number in the tenths place is less than the number in the tenths place for 6.35. So 6.25 is the right answer. 